Just relax, all right? I got you. Can't stop, won't stop. Get it, get it. What are these called? Let me zoom you in, all right? I'm gonna end up picking up. Oh, I got a message. It's already on. <laughs> message. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. This is P. Y'all know this. I thought this would be a really good chance to do a dupe video. I went to Walmart to go pick up some of these items up. Not everything's gonna be dupe. I just like decided like I went overboard a little bit. It's okay, it's okay. I'm gonna list the dupes somewhere around here, a picture or the name of the dupe. Um, now, these are dupes. They're not exactly, exactly, but they're like it. You know what I'm saying? All right. Oh, and I already opened, pre-opened these items up, so y'all know that it'll be fast. Yes. This is not a dupe, but this item will really help your eyebrows. Um, I ended up picking this a clear coincidence went and wild for a dollar You could pick this up at Walmart obviously um, And any of your local drugstore. This is a wax I, the way that I do my eyebrows I put the wax first that way I could know exactly what I'm gonna underline when I do my eyebrows This is really great. I already mentioned this product before thought I could mention it again thumbs up thumbs up up. And then I ended up picking these items up because uh, obviously one of our really really great girls from our group ended up picking these up and I really loved how it looked. Um, the new trend now I guess is you put your black eyeliner and then you put like a really nice like pop of color on top of that black eyeliner. It's freaking awesome. This one is in turquoise now. You know this one's gonna look the best when you have your black liner up. I'm gonna give you guys a little swatchy swatch. Extremely pigmented. And I love it. And it's right there. Don't mind the other swatches because I just made another video before this. The next one is in Plum. So this one is a very dark purple. Now when you do Plum, I really suggest you do a white liner first. I really wanted the white one and they didn't have it. They were actually sold out, um, which really sucks. And like I said, these are extremely pigmented. These remind me of the Glide On pencils from Urban Decay. Just saying. Just saying. And this one is called H2O Proof. This liquid eyeliner. This one is a hard tip. Um, and this one is an espresso. Alright. And here's a little swatch. Swatch. The tip is hard. The line is obviously going to be more thinner. Um, but I thought these were extremely great just to mess around with your eyes. Right. I ended up picking up some nail polishes this one is from pure eyes i love this brand i ended up trying this on like right there like a little like you know i know a lot of people don't like that but i do it anyway uh, this one is in the color uh 1201 can't stop it's extremely perfect for spring and summer so i got this and um i only ended up putting one coat and this thing was like pigmented as hell these are from sinful color these are really pigmented as well and this one um, I like this one because if you guys don't follow Luxure Lux, I really enjoy um, watching her Snapchats. She ended up putting a post of her nails and it's called Baby Breath. And it looks sort of like this color, like an eggshell kind of color. So it's like a really nice like nude white, if that makes sense. Um, this one is called Beaches and Cream. Beaches, alright? And then the other one is called Bacache vacation time this kind of like brown red like brick red kind of color this one is actually my favorite color when i do my nail polishes i have another one from revlon and revlon sells great great nail polishes as well these um those are my favorite ones to pick up at the drugstore but sinful life who would have ever thought you know i always thought that these were really cheap in comparison with others but i was wrong and i'm sorry all right the next item i ended up getting is this covergirl in classic tan this is supposed to be a dupe um, which obviously I'll list it somewhere. Obviously this is to contour. The CoverGirl brand smells like, I don't know, it smells different from my usual stuff. Um, it, for me it doesn't smell bad, I could control the smell. And this thing is like extremely pigmented like crazy and this will give you like a really sun kiss um, contour or bronze whatever you want to use it for this thing is awesome this is for five dollars at Walmart these sponge applicators are actually really good when you're baking you could like really sharpen that line really good you guys the best items I ended up picking up there you guys like you really have to stop this video and go get it right now in my group we talked about these for a good period of time and these are the wet and wild mega last liquid lipsticks these are all wet and wild these remind me so much of the Anastasia Beverly Hills lippies that she came out with or like lip gloss, whatever, like they dry out matte. These two exactly the same. Let me bust out the other one because I already used one. 
hold up. I already had this one and I'm like, oh hell yeah, I need to pick up more and I did. This one doesn't have the name. I'm, I don't know why it doesn't have a name, but it's like the brown one that they have there. I'm sorry. This is just all wrong, all right? I don't know why this one, it probably did have the name. It just like smeared off. The applicator looks like a lip gloss applicator, but yo, this thing, like it folds really nicely to your lips and look at this pigmentation. These dry up extremely matte, so I would really, really suggest that you put a very nice um, lip pencil, not lipstick, that is really moist. A lip pencil that's creamy, that glides on creamy, and then put this on top because it will leave your lips really dry at the end. These last a long time. So this is the first one. That one did not have a name, and this one's the first one that I picked up because one of you girls ended up recommending it. This one is called Do I Make You Blush, and this one is a very hot pink. Just take a moment and realize that your life is gonna change after this video when you pick these up and these are like two bucks or two to three dollars at your drugstore and Rite Aid always has a good sell on these so best believe and this one is like a very like vampy red oh, this one's my favorite this one is called Raisin the Roof guys brace yourselves look at that and trust me by the end of the video these are going to be matte and they last all day and when I say it lasts all day these last all freaking day you literally have to scrub off your lips until they bleed this one is called cherry on the top and this one's obviously a red color and these are like so glossy but they dry up matte look at this one swipe you guys isn't that freaking incredible for three bucks this is the BS the last one this one is a very hot pink back to fuchsia oh. Can, can we just take a moment? The color that you see here is the color that it gets on your lips. Look at that, you guys. It's like the heavens are calling out for you guys to go get these. The next item, this one's the ALF Shimmering Facial Whip in Lilac Petal. This is a highlighter. This one is a dupe for this one right here. But it was just a dollar, so I just really wanted to try it. A little goes a long way. This is just too much. But one swipe, and this is a highlighter one swipe boom 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 isn't that so pretty this one is a very nice highlighter and as you keep rubbing it highlights even more um, you really want a luminous finish on your foundation you end up mixing that with your foundation if you guys want a review on how I do that go ahead and leave me a comment down below but these are so worth it I'll pick them up. I ended up getting another dupe. This one is 420 in blushed, and this one is from Revlon. This is a very nice, sultry kind of lipstick, and it looks extremely nice. The bad thing about these is that they're not matte. Since it doesn't last a long time, you do have to keep it in your puss um, for touch ups. Lastly, I ended up going to the 99 cent store yesterday. My boyfriend ended up buying me four lip pencils um, from the brand Italia. Am I saying this right? Now, when I was young, I used to um, go at dollar stores or whatever and play with makeup, like the 99 cent. This one was one of the brands that I would usually get back in the day, and it wasn't that great. But holy crap. Okay, I ended up getting these three or these four kinds. Um, and the one that is a dupe and I will swipe first is Moi. I am wearing this one right now, and let me tell you guys that I ended up putting this one, what time did I leave? At one. I ended up leaving at 1 and it's now 8 and I have not touched up. This one is in mauve and just a couple of swipes you guys and you are set. These are extremely creamy and if you guys are having a hard time really defining your lip, always sharpen the pencil before you apply so you can really define your lips before, before you actually apply it. So that one is a dupe and then this one is in natural beige. I don't know why my mouth is getting watery all of a sudden. And this one is in natural beige right there. The next one is in hot coca. Yes, matte. You could literally put this all over your lip and you would have a matte lipstick. And the last one is called Cabaret. And this one is like a really brown red type of lippy right there. Isn't that so awesome? Alright guys, that's the whole video. I hope you guys like it. It was very intense in here. For some reason it's hot. Go ahead and do me a favor and share this video to other fellow members of the group. And go ahead and subscribe to my channel, share this video. And also don't forget to follow me on Snapchat. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.